Hey, what's up? Hello and welcome. My name is Maya and today we have an episode of Whimsy Stories and I am loving Noelle's new look. But before we get started, I want to give a shout out to the Simmers. Thank you so much for all of your support. And yeah, I gave Noelle a new look because a part of this generation is that she has to dye her hair often. So she got a whole new look. And she tends to switch up her hair when she's ready to switch up her relationship. So hint, hint, we will be leaving her relationship today. But I have some things planned with that. If you're excited, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. But yeah, we're going to get started. So right now it's love day and Noelle is on a date. And it's not with her fiance. She got asked on a date by her friend. Uh, she's keeping it real cute though because she is engaged. Her friend is Bryson. He is heading in. They do have like a romance bar but they haven't like really talked in a while and he did text her and ask her like do you want to go on a date for love day and she said yes <laughs> because it's noel where is he? he's right here okay let's go talk to him i think though she said yes because she's supposed to get married today and she's nervous about it so she kind of wants to talk to a few of her friends to see like what she should do she's also sad from losing a friend who died i don't even know who died you don't even know really know this sim. I'm gonna cheat that because we don't really know that sim that died and I don't they don't even have a name. But Bryson literally asked this out to the new crest center and I said yes. Yeah. So that's where we are. But she got also a new look. She's looking great. I love Noelle so much. She looks so good. But you guys said that you guys want her to have another kid. I do too. I think though her third baby father would be somebody she doesn't really know. Oh, we learned Bryson is romantic. Oh, well, we're not here for romance. We need talk about marriage. We need help. We don't know if we should get married. Oh, why are you yelling at him? Who are you? Express doubts about marriage. Oh my goodness, this guy's angry. But she's like, yeah, I don't think I want to get married. And he's like, then don't do it. She's like, but yeah, we're supposed to get married tonight. Oh, I got this new mod that's like Curious Inquiry, so I want to check it out. Feeling energized and you're not sure why you feel energized? Okay. I want to ask about woohoo history. Why are we meeting this random elder? Never woohooed with anyone. That's embarrassing. No one should ask Noelle about her woohoo history because it's extensive. But yeah, she just wanted to talk to him about basically should she get married. He said no. But I think she needs like more uh, order for here. I want to get a drink. Let's get the barista's recommendation. But she's like unsure if she should get married. I'm telling you right now she's not getting married. But... <laughs> Uh, Daniela thinks she is. Daniela's home right now. Oh, and if you notice, our kids are not in our household because they are visiting their father. So that's why she, it's like a perfect time for her to get married because she's like, my kids aren't home and we could just quickly get it done. But I think Daniela is planning all of this. Ooh, is this a hideous scene? Seeing a hideous sim? Is she hideous? She's not hideous. She's beautiful, actually. Let me let me introduce myself. Oh, the barista's being all nice. I hope you enjoy. Ah, he stole our drink so annoying i hate because like why would you oh i didn't mean to click enchanting introduction but are we surprised she would definitely do something like that i think megan thinks she's dramatic or she thinks she's megan's dramatic i don't know oh she thinks she's big basic looking though i think megan's pretty she's like a cute sim yeah very cute all right um where's her date though <laughs> bryson's probably like what are you doing i'm actually let me drink my drink because this guy stole my drink they literally didn't invite anyone to their wedding. That should tell you. Well, she didn't want to invite anyone to her wedding. She's just like kind of going to get married. Oh my goodness. She's doing everything but talk to Bryson. What was the point of this date? I think the point of the date was for her to realize uh, she kind of doesn't want to get married. She likes to flirt and have fun. I think that was the point of the date. I'm just seeing what's around here. It's cool. It's a community lot type of thing. I think it's a cafe technically, but it looks like a community lot. Let's use the bathroom. And then we are going to go and I guess get married, quote unquote. But at least that's what Daniela thinks. <laughs> we know she's not. I just wanted to end this relationship quickly because Daniela just kind of rushed it. Like no one told her. Oh, is this the hideous sim? Because we came in here and we got so disgusted. Dang. I think it is. But yeah, I want her to hurry up, use the bathroom. We're going to go somewhere to get married. Why is her ex texting her? See, like, so many people from her past is coming back. Hashim is her ex. And he's married. Interesting. 
But yeah, so many people from her past are texting her, and she's like, yeah, I'm definitely not not ready for this. I think she's planning to go to the wedding venue that they said they'll meet at and break it off with her. Um, I feel bad for Daniela because she like, moved in and everything, but girl, Noel is not meant to be kept. But anyway, let's go and I guess break it off with Daniela. All right, they're here. And Noel, Noel is extra. She's like in her wedding dress and everything. She's tense. Daniela makes her tense. Talk about the marriage. Like, so do you really want to go in and do this? Like, none of our family's here. And Danielle was like, but I love you and I want to get married. Like, let's just go in and do it. And Noelle's like stomach is all in knots because she's like, no, she doesn't want to go through with this. Ask about Danielle's mood. Like, how are you feeling? Are you sure? She's feeling smug. These Sims have excessive pride in themselves and their achievements. Oh, yeah. She's feeling confident that this is going to work out. She's telling her she's doubting this marriage, though. No, wait. <laughs> wait, you guys, we can get so much money and we're poor. Like, should we get married? <laughs> this is like fate. Okay, I guess she's going to get married. I guess she'll get a divorce. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's go get married. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. Let's worry about the wedding first and then we'll get married to her. That's like hilarious. I was so ready to break it off. Noelle was so ready to break it off. But here we are. She's coming in like, okay, I'm going to do this. <laughs> I can't believe she's really going to go get married. That's like crazy. But I want that money. She's like, Ugh, I don't think I should get married. And look how tense she is. And Danielle is coming. <sighs> she's going to get married to her, you guys. This is such a weird wedding. <sighs> I can't. I can't believe. I had no... No plan to get married this stream or this episode. Like, none at all. Like, I really did not want them to get married. Noelle does not look happy. I'm not happy, but she wants that money, I guess. This is going to be a messy divorce. But sometimes you got to let the Sims do what they do. Well, good thing I, I gave them actually wedding looks. My plan was for her to, like, just break off the wedding. But they're exchanging vows. I was going to call off the wedding. That's what I was going to do. But here she is getting married for money. Maybe Daniela has money, so she's using her. That seems more like Noelle, to be honest. But she's married, you guys. 24. See, good thing we got married. She, look how happy she is. She's like, oh, perfect. I can't believe she got freaking married. The timing on that was crazy. I can't believe it. I can't believe we got married. Okay. Well, they're married now. <laughs> I guess we should go out somewhere, right? To celebrate their marriage. Uh, I was planning, because you guys wanted Noelle to have a third kid. So I was going to plan to do that. Uh, I think they are going to, well, quote unquote, Noelle's going to say, let's get like pregnant through IVF, I guess. And Noelle is just really going to sleep with someone and get pregnant. I already know who I want her to have a kid with. But yeah, that's crazy. All right, let us go on our i guess a date oh because we need to have three gold dates anyway and i should have tried to make made the date with bryson gold but i guess i didn't so let's go on a date with daniela and it'd be like their wedding night somewhere and hopefully we can get a gold on that date i can't believe she just got married I'm like <laughs> help all right they're here in their wedding dresses i still can't believe they got freaking married all right um let's order drinks because i i feel for her she needs a strong drink, actually. We're at a restaurant, though, here in the Stargazer lot. So I've been to this restaurant before with Sims. It's raining, though, so I'm not going to eat outside. Let us... Where would be a nice place to eat? I kind of want to eat on the first floor. Look how far they're sitting. I think Noelle is nervous to be married, but I think she's trying to make it work. She's like... In her head, like, okay, I'm at the age I should be married, I guess, and should have, like, a relationship. It's really because she, like, grew up with her dad not being married, and she doesn't want to give her kids a stable life and all of that. But I think it's just going to be hard for her to stay married. And I was thinking about it some more because, like, honestly, this has just happened. And this was not a part of my plan. My plan was for them to break off the marriage and her to be single this whole episode. But now we have Noelle married. <laughs> which is like just crazy, crazy. So my plan is that um, she's going to try to make this marriage work. And I want to play around with like the open relationship mod because I can see Noelle trying to have an open relationship with Daniela and then Daniela 
not really be with it like say she is and then end up getting jealous so i think because i've never played with that mod and i have it so i might as well use it and noelle is the perfect person to try it on so i think that's the plan and while they're in an open relationship i think noelle is going to get pregnant and that's going to cause the divorce so we'll see we'll see but for right now they need to come and request their table before somebody takes it thanks <laughs> I still can't believe she's married. Alright, I kind of actually try to get a gold on this. So come sit. I honestly don't remember when her kids are coming back home. <laughs> Is she drunk already? Alright, we have to socialize with our date. Let's order for table two. Alright, let's get us another drink. Let's get wine. It is their wedding. And then... And we got money now. Um, Let's get this one. And this one. Yeah, here we go. Good. Food's ordered. We need to have two deep conversations. I wonder if she will start talking about open relationships already. Confess loving another. No, not yet. Woohoo life. Ask to engage. All right. I want to see if I can edit her settings first. Uh, yeah, they can be close. I don't. Okay. Let's not like just end their marriage straight off the bat. Let her Let her be married for a little bit. This might be her only marriage. Who knows with her, though? Um, oh, she already has a very high. I was going to change it to very high, but hers was very high already. Um, add a woohoo style. This is, like, so new. I think adventurous would fit her. Yeah, like, adventurous. Oh, we can choose more. Dominant, for sure. And kinky? Okay. I don't know. Okay, I think that's good. Okay, this is what she wants in a partner. All right, I'm going to make her open about woohoo life. Okay, that's good. All right, and then I want to edit Daniela's too. I think their woohoo life is the reason why they're going to end up divorced. So I want her to have... Oh, hers is already very low. I didn't I didn't choose that, okay? Um, let me add style. She likes romantic and tender, and I'll make her vanilla. Okay. She wants somebody romantic and tender, and she wants somebody traditional. Okay. So they're like not compatible. Now we can ask her. I wonder what it's going to say now. Ask to engage in expanded woohoo. I wonder what she's going to say. I've never done this before, so I wanted to just try this out. This comes with relationship pregnancy and overhaul. This is just an idea, but would you be interested in engaging in extended woohoo arrangements like swinging or multiple sim woohoo and woohoo parties? Um, She's going to lie. She just got married. She wants to stay married. She's going to say I'm open to the idea, Um, but she's really not. She's really not. So we'll see how it impacts her over time. I don't know if we'll do anything this episode with them, but I think Noelle's decided if she is going to be with somebody, it has to be an open relationship or it's not going to work for her. That's just her personally. All right, let's have the last deep conversation we need to have. Ooh, our food's here. Okay, let's eat this. Drink this. Okay. Oh, this is so cute, though. In their little wedding outfits. Oh, Ask about see. relationship goals. I mean, you guys are already married. <laughs> I think that's... Oh, Daniela does not like it. Daniela is like, this is disgusting. Okay. Enthuse about male. Oh, it's because she's not level 5 cooking, so she can't even learn it. Oh, they, they got a sentiment, though. I think their marriage will be cute at first, okay? This is definitely taking a different turn. Because I did not see any of this happening, to be honest. Okay, goal date. Yay! Daniel is not interested in this conversation. Okay. I'm sorry it's boring. I'm trying to get a gold date. Alright, we're gonna ask about Daniela in general. Because honestly, they don't really know that much about each other. It's kind of a whirlwind, but it's cute, I guess. Ask about style turnoffs. Um, in terms of personality, I say I'm okay, we learned all of her things. She likes deep thought, streetwear, hipster, vintage video game, and she's right-handed. I forgot Sims have like um different like things like their Sims can be right or left handed. I always forget that. Okay, they're being cute. We're gonna end this meal soon, soon as she's done with her drink, because Noelle is tired. But I think if the kids are still gone tomorrow, they might go out and try to like swing and meet somebody to hook up with. I think they'll Noelle is like, okay, she said she's like with it. I was thinking maybe somebody we already know. And I don't know if you guys remember Ace from the beginning. But he's an adult. So Ace is a possibility. There's also Bryson, who she already went on a date with this episode. Or we can meet somebody new. 
So there's definitely a few possibilities with Noel, but it seems like the date was good, so we're gonna end meal and pay for bill. I think they're trying to save up for a house now. Now that we have twenty-seven thousand, she does want to buy her kids a house eventually, but right now money's looking tight. And if they do get a divorce, Daniela would get half the money. So who knows? Who knows? All right, let's end the date. They're gonna head home. They probably will woohoo tonight because you know, if you know, you know. And also for here. Okay, I checked out the two, but Danielle is technically the fifth girlfriend. It just never counted. So a reminder, when we get to seven, I'm going to take it off. But anyway, we're going to head back home and I'll pick back up in the morning. So I wasn't even going to pick back up right now because I wanted to just get out of the house and do something. So we were here beer brewing and we we're going to do a sale. And then she decided to ask Bryson to woohoo in the dumpster. She just got married yesterday. I don't know if they're going to actually do it, but they were propositioned. So I want to see if they're going to do it. I'm not going to interrupt them. If they want to go and woohoo, I guess so. And I don't know if she has protection to use. She does. Oh my goodness. Noelle literally just got married. I, I swear on everything. I did not tell her to do this. I wasn't even going to pick back up right now. Can she not use this? Use the protection. You guys see, I'm, I'm actually trying. I didn't want her to get pregnant. Is it on auto use? Like, please. She's like refusing. I can't use it. So, well, are you kidding me? No protection use. I, I try. They're disgusting. Noelle is disgusting and everyone's disgusting. And mind you, her baby father's just right here. Something is wrong with her, seriously. Collect, can you not go and collect? All right, so my game just glitched and sent them home. Will sent Noel home, but she did woohoo still. Okay, she did woohoo. She's gonna just go to work though. All right, and we are playing with Daniela now. Daniela has no job. I'm gonna think I'm gonna put her in the entertainer career because she wants to be a joke star. So I'll give her a job, <laughs> something to do. All right, let's put her in entertainer. All right, she's telling jokes. All right, she's already level three. Nice. I'm missing the kids. I think when Noel gets home, we're gonna invite them over because our and their visits because i miss them but i think i want to pick back up is tomorrow noel's birthday no oh my goodness i think she's pregnant her birthday moved i think her birthday was supposed to be on saturday i think she's pregnant by bryson oh my goodness well we're not gonna have her do a pregnancy test when she gets home because she doesn't want <sighs> i think they're gonna have to have like an expanded woohoo so i won't invite the kids back yet i think i'm gonna invite ace over and have them woohoo all three of them oh this is messy but are we surprised that Noelle is messy? I, I don't think I am. Okay. Well, we'll wait until Noelle gets home. Okay. Noelle is home. Okay. She doesn't know she's pregnant yet. So I'm going to have her wake up Daniela. This is like the messiest episode. Okay. Wake up Daniela. And then we're going to be like, hey, do you want to like drink and stuff and invite somebody over? So I'm going to have them like change their outfits to something better and then invite Ace over. I did want to get her pregnant by Ace, but I think she's pregnant oh by gosh, Bryson, but I don't know. Because her birthday definitely moved today, and we're going to be proactive. Let's change into this. Okay, girl, you are not even that tired. Get up. I don't even think she has a good outfit. Actually, let's change into party outfits then. Yeah, what she has on is actually fine. Okay, they need to stop going to sleep. Okay, you need to come collect this and make drinks and all of that. She's nervous. This is her first time doing something like this so she's going to practice pickup lines is ace over here okay ace is coming all right let's have her introduce herself to ace he's here okay we can make drink let's do a strawberry margarita hey i have a son okay ace is here cool 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 i'm gonna have to lock him in here because he keeps trying to leave and we're not doing that so come sit in here she's flirty because ace is here she's making drinks for everyone all right, let's also do gentle romance. That's a good one. They are seeming to get to know each other. What do you think of Ace? Okay. Ace thinks Daniela is interesting, strong-minded. Thinks reasonable. Ace, are you attracted to Daniela? I don't know. But we're going to sit him in there and then lock him in. <laughs> lock for everyone but household. Okay, good. How about you guys come in here and sit and get to know each other some more? We're going to just do a little flirt. She knows why he's here. I'm sure they talked about this. Okay, she made one drink. We'll give this to Daniela because she needs it the most. Oh, we need to make a drink for Ace too. I think he wants just some vodka. They're seeming to get to know each other. Building their romance up a little bit. This is like so scandalous, honestly. Okay, let me get the drinks. Everyone's eating. 
Come drink, everyone drink. I swear. Only Noelle would do something like this. But Danielle was trying to keep the the romance alive, I guess. I thought she already agreed to swinging. Oh, ask about swinging with other sim. So what do you think about Ace? I told you he was cool. Um, She's open to the idea. Sure, it's okay. I'd be okay with swinging with Ace. Go ask him. This is like so awkward. You guys. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Can we ask? They're They're finishing their drinks up. Ask about swinging. Let's ask him what he thinks. Okay, he's also open up to the idea. A charming proposition. Count us in. Well, I don't actually. I don't think he has, is. He in a relationship with someone? I don't know. Okay, can now now would it work? I don't know. Okay, yeah. Woohoo! With multiple partners. Okay, I guess it will work. I don't know if it's working. Okay, let's see if it works now. They're all in the room. Okay. Now she's going to ask Ace if he wants to join them in the bedroom. Oh my goodness, this is just too much. Okay, she's trying to go to sleep. All right, they're all going into the room. We're going to let them do what they do. But now, if she does get pregnant, her wife will think she's got pregnant from this whole interaction that they have going on in the other room. But it's now five in the morning. I'm going to... I'm going to pick back up when they actually get up and stuff. I can hear the woohoo music, but yeah. Definitely, definitely Noelle's type of vibe. All right, it's the next day, and Noelle is picking up her kids from Santos. Uh, ignore that Josh is also here because I can't have Jameson go stay with Santos because he's not his biological father, but he did stay with Josh. So I think that Josh and him did build up a relationship. I don't mind that. I think he should know his dad. It's just that, uh, so now him, him and Josh are friends. That's like his father and they have like a fine relationship. But Santos is the baby father that Noel is actually closest to. Okay, this little girl wants to get put down. All right, all right, all right, all right. Go ahead, yes, go play. She's like, I want to go play. And she's hungry. I don't know if there's anywhere to go eat at this part. I don't know, but we can play with cards. Oh, we can make her food. It is some World Cup day, so I also want to do that. So let's grill some food for the kids. A nice little, a nice little um, family day. She's exhausted still because she didn't get any sleep. But I think I'm gonna get her a sleep replacement for this. She literally just like left doing what she did last night and then came and picked up her kids. But you know, moms never sleep, I guess. I also want to work on her skills for the end part of this episode. Uh, right now she's level nine mixology. We just need to get that to level 10. And we also need to work on her beer brewing for her career. She doesn't work today, but she's level nine. I think one more episode and she'll be level 10 of both the skill and her career, which is good. Uh, how about you talk to your biological father? <laughs> get to know him a little bit. Oh, wait, maybe he can help fix the relationship with his mom. Ask about another sim. Oh, you can ask about his relationship with your mom. Okay, the food is made. Great. Did you drink your drink? You're hungry too. So how about you come eat? Oh goodness, her and Josh are talking. Awful. She's like, so did you meet your son? They now despise each other. Noel, you could just never be good. <laughs> your son is trying to work on this relationship for you. So they adore their son, so I guess that's cute. All right, he's going to go talk to his dad and try to fix this relationship for them. You're so awkward. Why? Why? I don't really like Noel. Well, all right, he's going to try to help fix bad relationship with... Oh, oh, wait, this is a sim. This is a sim from Chicken Ramen Soup, uh, who is a great supporter on my channel. Her name is Cleo, and she's our new neighbor. Oh, my God getting along but i just want to show you i put down cleo and her kids so maybe her kids are here she has a toddler and a child which is like what we have so i think she'll be a great friend um she her and her flirty and just give a cheerful introduction okay yes. you are a married woman he's like please mom and dad please get along oh james and always trying to fix relationships is sad if he does take over next gen maybe this is where he gets his fixer attitude from and of course santos is over here just being a good dad why can't we all be more like Santos, huh? She's being cute with her dad. How cute. I don't know if the relationship fixing worked. I doubt it. I think Josh left. He was so angry, but we might as well take a pregnancy test here. <laughs> Figure this out. And she met Cleo. I want to see what she thinks of Cleo, but she's going into this tiny little bathroom to figure out if she's pregnant. You guys, this might be it. This might be the third one. Yeah, look at her face. 
I think she's definitely pregnant, y'all. Oh, she is. No. She's like, wait, what? Yeah, third time's the charm. Goodness, hot mess. Now she has to go and tell her wife. A child on the way, yeah, Noelle is pregnant. Noelle didn't woohoo with her Fisher partner recently in any way that can cause pregnancy, so there's no way the baby's theirs, and of course they'll know. Oh, goodness. So much for trying to hide it. Oh, goodness, this is gonna be awkward. She stinks, though. She's like, oh. Oh, yeah. He's supportive of Henny. That's so cute. She loves her dad. She's a daddy's girl, for sure. And she can now talk. That's so cute. But I think, oh goodness, I think he knows something's up with his mom. I mean, she's holding her stomach like she's nauseous. Let's ask him, does he want a sibling? Wait, let's teach about responsibility. Yeah, you need you need a lesson in res Bryson was just right there. Should we tell him where that we're pregnant now? I guess, I guess she should. <sighs> okay, Noel's a hot mess. Let's ask if he wants a sibling. And then we're going to tell Bryson that we are pregnant. This is just the awkward exchange of baby fathers, apparently, right? Well, at least she's cleaning up after her daughter well i want to see what did she think of not destiny of cleo <laughs> noelle thinks cleo is untrustworthy and they have anti-crush but she perceives her as attractive i don't know how well we'll get along with cleo but maybe our kids would get along with her kids oh goodness i want to click on let me see if it would tell me who's the father may have fathered noelle's child oh yeah this is the second time she doesn't know who's the baby father <laughs> she's just all types of embarrassing i can't with her I can't, but she's asking her son, does he want a sibling? Because a sibling's coming. I think he would say no way. He doesn't want, I don't want a new sibling. You guys live in a crappy small apartment. He doesn't even know his mom is married. Let's have a uh, reveal a deep secret. Yeah, so we got married and mommy's pregnant. <laughs> Jameson is done with his mom. He's done with his mom. And then we're going to announce news. Okay, we're going to tell him, yes, we did get pregnant. Oh, he's not happy. He's so mad at his mom. He was mad, but he's like, it's okay. Yeah, supportive. I think he'll support his mom through anything. Oh, level 10 social. That's not bad. Okay, she really has to use the bathroom and wash hands. Okay, and then we, we need to tell Bryson. I really think Bryson is the baby father, but it's really... Who knows? She doesn't know. All right, after she washes her hands, I mean, he's here. Did you not even go to the bathroom, girly? All right, she's telling him that she's pregnant, I think. Oh, he's not happy. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. <laughs> he's like, so you want child support? Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> we do. I think he's leaving. Try to reassure a pregnancy. Like, listen, this is not my first rodeo. I know. I know it can be a lot. But I'm a good mom. <laughs> kind of. Oh, there's a shower here. We could have showered. Okay, hold on. Let me just use the bathroom. Santos is like... Jimson is telling Santos immediately, like, you know my mom's pregnant again? Big mouth. Big mouth Sa um, Jameson. Okay, we might as well tell Santos officially since Jameson is telling him that she's pregnant. This is just awkward. I don't know a pregnancy to him. I can't believe she's having another kid. You guys have to give me some names down below. I think I'm going to play until second trimester so we can figure out what she's having. But I'm not going to go and do an ultrasound like last time. I'm just going to do it through the mod. Unhappy family. A family member reacted poorly. Yeah, Jameson. Oops, from announcing pregnancy. Oh, goodness. She told everyone but her wife that she's pregnant. Announced news of pregnancy to Tennessee. Jameson is like over it. Ooh, there's a cute girl here. Oh, Ivy aged up. Cute. This is Newhart and uh, Ikea's um, daughter. So let's introduce ourselves to her. Mm -mm. Oh, this is this is uh, Cleo's daughter. I think her name's like Caitlin or something. But he's making friends here at the park. Cute. Yeah, her name is Caitlin. Let's give her introduction as well. I don't think Santos is too mad about her being pregnant. I don't. Santos is the only baby father that will tolerate her. I love that Bryson just left once she told him that she's pregnant. She's like, oh no. He's like, oh, oh no. Okay, I think he's leaving too. Oh, cute. She's being a cute little papa. Oh no, Bryson is still here. Bryson. I want to ask him. I think we can ask him why he's mad. I wonder if he's going to be honest. Ask about his mood. Love is calling to chat. She's telling her sister, oh yeah, I'm going to have another kid soon. Jameson is over here with his new friends. Cute. Oh, another friend. Let's give him a friendly introduction. Oh, Ivy's or their son aged up. 
<laughs> the CC on him is hilarious. Uh, oh, he's being honest. Oh, I'm feeling tense because of this. Troubling announcements. Bryson's partner announced being pregnant. They're not widely excited about it. Just kind of neutral to positive, a reasonable reaction. Bryson, however, he finds himself incapable of reacting with anything but dismay and dread. A child, no thanks. He told her straight up, I don't want to have a kid with you. Well, I don't want to have a kid with you either. Okay, so there's that. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to decide. Should we just ask to be boyfriend just to take one off? All right, I'm going to ask to be boyfriend. Not because I want them to be together, but because I want to do this for her. As oh, he left. He said no. He said absolutely not. Well, thanks. Thanks for that. How awful. Well, it's almost time to go home soon. I'm glad you're making friends, though. I will have to give Franklin... I I'm going to give all his friends makeovers. Wait, who is this? Because I want to meet her, too. I don't think I did. Allison Kudo. Let's give her introduction as well. Let me see... He's level 10 social already. He needs to work on mental, creativity, motor, all of the skills. All of the skills. He has like nine days to age up though. Oh, cute. Look at her holding her daughter. It's just like a cute little family day. I'm glad Santos stuck around. Don't ask me why Danielle didn't come. She didn't come. Okay, we are going to go home soon anyway. Um, Can you take this? Why do you keep picking her up? You know she doesn't like to get picked up. She's like, put me down, mommy. Put me down. <laughs> cute i love hennessy she's just the cutest let's see if he would change her diaper cute him and his new friends singing with them henny is level four communication cool bryson's just sticking around just to be evil like bryson if you do want the kid or not all right we're gonna have to head home soon and face face the wrath of our baby mother mischievous soul nearby is it Bryson? Oh, wait. is If he's still around, I'm gonna ask him. No, he's not. He left. Okay, I was gonna ask him out. Just fine. Maybe he'll come over and ask her. I don't know. Alright, it's time to go home. Okay, let's go home. Alright, bye Santos. Thanks for hanging out. Santos is like the coolest baby father, but Noelle's on her way home with her children. I can't believe she's gonna be a mom again. Craziness. Look at this. Look at this. This series, I can't deal with this series. Hey, Noel, I think I have a crush on love. Her sister, I'm going to say, do what your heart tells you. If they end up together, you guys, I'm going to scream. If he turns out to be her baby father, I'm going to scream. <laughs> we have to settle this as soon as we get home. All right, we're home. And Daniela just brought fireworks for the kids. Like, it's some World Cup. She wants it to be a great day. And she has no clue that Noel is going to come in here and tell her that she's pregnant. I'm going to give the kids the fireworks so that way they can play outside i don't think toddlers can use it but i think he can no she can't play with it boo but at least jameson can play with his little sparkler happy sim world cup day he's so cute he's having fun all right time for them to learn the truth she went in there she's like i need a moment okay oh, i guess you're gonna go shower just rip the band-aid off and tell her ask if she wants children first i guess she's coming out here to talk to her so do you want children she's neutral to having children okay well we're pregnant i don't think she can announce it to her i think she knows i guess she's just telling her that she's pregnant i don't know oh she feels horror oh she's angry about this unfaithful love well no, you said we can have an open relationship. Okay, I guess, I guess this is where the arguments start, right? I think she's going to express fear that she cheated on her with Ace. I feel like she doesn't even know about Bryson, but I feel like with Ace, they use protection. So she's like, how are you pregnant? Do you like see him without me? I thought it was just with us. And mind you, Jameson is right here. Just hearing this conversation, like, can somebody light the fireworks for me? Was she honest about it? Oh, she's crying. Danielle's partner just confessed to having woohoo with another. What should Danielle do? I'm going to let fate decide what she does. I don't know what she's going to decide to do. Oh, and she's filling her tummy. She's just happy about being pregnant. What did you decide to do? Ah, to believe that your most... Hold on. <laughs> to me, your most loved one is truthful in their affections only to hear them say they gave them to another. But if the woohoo only or be it for the woohoo only or be it more than that, cheating is cheating and Danielle heart aches. I don't know what she decided to do. Okay, only time will tell whether giving that cheater a second chance to be faithful was the right decision. So she decided to stay because she's like, you know what? We did agree to an open relationship, I guess. This place is a mess, this, this whole thing. I think she's going to go and put Henny to sleep. Oh, Danielle, no. How about you light the fireworks out here? Jameson, get up before you go to sleep. Come. It's Friday. Come in and enjoy the fireworks. All right, we're putting her to sleep. 
off the hook. Noelle's partner decided to give her a second chance. Noelle, don't squander this. We'll see how long this lasts. Okay. Oh, the fireworks. Are you watching? You missed it. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful though. Enjoying the fireworks. Noelle's watching too. Cute. This was a weird sim world day. Definitely, definitely a Noelle style sim world day. She managed to get married, get pregnant, cheat. Just a whole lot this episode. I want her to check though, so we can know what she's having. I don't know if she can check the baby, what she's having now. Let's see. She can discover baby's number and gender. I'm gonna have her go do that now. We're gonna just pretend she did it in the morning, but I wanna end this episode with figuring it out. Jameson, this is so cute. This is definitely a core memory for him, him and the fireworks. He's like, this is so cool. Oh, I love Jameson. Okay, how about you? Play with yeah. sparklers again. He's like, this is great. Oh, I love him. Okay, how about you? Oh, cute. She's like, happy some world day, kid. And they became good friends. Safe to say Jameson likes his stepmother. Jameson just gets along with everyone, bright and day. Are you excited to be a big brother? He's like, no, actually, I'm not. Okay, instead of lighting the sparkler, actually, let us... Oh, cute. Let us put him to sleep. Can we? Yeah, put Jameson to bed. I was cracking up when China was like, one thing about Noelle, she's always going to find someone to take care of her kids, and that is really her down. One thing is she's not going to be with somebody that's not nice to her kids, and Daniela does love the kids, which I think is also why she's staying. I mean, she's married now, so she's like, mm, kind of have to stay. I don't think she has, like, family or anything. Yeah, Noelle's her only family. All right, Jameson, time for bed. He went straight to sleep. He had a great day. Cute. Cute. She's going to wait until... Oh, is she back? She's back. Do you know what you're having? I didn't say. Hmm. Um, okay. Are you going to tell us what you're having? Oh, announce baby gender. Okay, are we going to know? Are we going to know? This is new. We're having a... What? We still don't know. I don't know. What are you having? I still don't know what we're having, you guys. <laughs> okay so it's the next day because i'm trying to figure out if we can check when she's in the second trimester and she's almost in her second trimester so i'm gonna send her again and see if we can figure out the gender of the baby but ace and love are together <sighs> let's hope that's not her baby father i guess we should invite bryson over secretly and check to see if he's the baby father oh and he's here okay good 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 all right get up we got a lot to do before we ask to join in bed what the heck Asked to do a paternity test. Okay, we're gonna see if he's the father. Sneak out there. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Daniel didn't see. And she's feeling very flirty. He's like avoiding all conversation. No, you should not really get going. He doesn't want to, like, do you not want to know this? Lovo. No, it's no leaving. Nope. He's saying, does he not want to go? Okay, he's gonna do paternity. Jesus Christ. Where is. She's like starving. Where are you going? Why would you go all the way? You know, eat this. Okay, paternity testing. He is the father. Oh no, she's going to work. Don't go to work. Don't go to work. Yeah. I need to figure out the gender. So Bryson is the father. It's not Ace, like Daniela thinks. How is that going to come about? I don't know. Oh, okay. Let's see if we can finally figure out what she's having. Just go quickly. Don't go to work. Oh, little Carly's out here. This is Cleo's other daughter. Oh, you're using your diaper. How about you meet Carly? A new friend for everyone. Okay, so she's just really not going to figure it out. You know how much money I wasted? Okay, I've tried every single way to figure out what she's having. And my MCC is not working, so I can't even check in here. So we're going to go and do an ultrasound. I think I have an ultrasound here. Yeah, I do. Okay. Um, Let's start an ultrasound scan. She's supposed to be at work, mind you. Okay, are we finally going to figure this out? Okay, I think we are. Yes. She's like, I already know what this is. Okay. Finally, are we finally figuring this out? I'm hoping for another girl. Okay, let's see what she's having. Okay, one baby. What are we having? Yay, another girl. Another girl. Cute. Cute. Okay, her and Bryson are having a girl. Daniela does not look too happy about this. All right, I'm going to end the episode off here. I felt like it was a longer episode, but we got a lot done. We got married, even though I didn't want to get married. Got pregnant. I did want that to happen, but not. I wanted her to get pregnant by Ace, but it's fine. It's fine. She's having her third and final kid. A girl, another girl. So leave me some names down below. Uh, alcohol brands, I prefer. Uh, since we already have Jam Jameson and Hennessy, I can't believe she's going to have a third kid. Let me know how you think this relationship with Danielle is going to uh, go down. Because 
we know we're not going to stay with her. And right now she thinks Ace is the father, which she's upset with, but not that upset because she did agree to an expanded woohoo with him. But she would soon find out that Ace is not the father Bryson is. And she doesn't even know Bryson. But that's going to throw her off, definitely. But anyway, I'm going to end the episode off here. Noelle is being Noelle. And I still love her, but she's definitely crazy. And I'm excited to have this third and final kid. I can't wait. But I appreciate you all so much. And I will see you guys all next time. Bye, everyone.